Hi guys, it's Andy here from the Postpartum Closet, and today I just wanted to do a quick video on the Mina Bay Audrey. Uh, at the time of filming, we're about uh, less than a week away from Thanksgiving, and Mina Bay has announced that they're going to be doing a pretty big Black Friday sale. So I thought I would come on here quickly and show you how I've got my Mina Bay Audrey bag packed up. I believe this bag is going to be 40% on Black Friday. Um, so here it goes. My daughter is two, so I don't have this packed up for an infant. She's potty training, so I don't carry as much as you might carry with an infant, but I thought it might still be helpful to see how the bag works. So I um, most often carry this as a shoulder bag, sometimes as a crossbody bag. The bag just adjusts with these uh, little button adjust. I don't know what you call these. They kind of just push through the little holes. Um, and there's a slider here to keep the strap from flopping around. Um, I keep mine fairly short. Today I did use it and I used it as a longer length shoulder bag. So this is in the color tan and this bag is um, kind of like an envelope style bag. I really think it's got some cute details on it. Um, this flap sticks in here um, and there is a magnet in there. There's also one on top so if you don't want to stick it in you could just lay it on top and it magnetizes like that. Um, and it's a pretty strong magnet. Um, it holds pretty well. I haven't had any issues with it coming open unexpectedly or anything like that. The back of the bag uh, just looks like this. It's got a single zipper back here. And I often keep my keys and my little uh, card wallet in here along with um, my small items. I have um, a little lip crayon some breath strips, just some smaller items, and it holds them, holds them all really well. I also keep my keys back here. Um, I wear this with denim. I do have a little bit of denim transfer on here. Um, I haven't tried to wipe it off yet. I probably should have before I tried filming this video, but I totally didn't think about it. But um, I'll give that a try, and hopefully it will come off, but I'm not too bothered by it because it's on the back of the bag. So the inside of the bag is, I really think this bag is so brilliant. Um, it's just a flap. The inside is... Um, pretty neutral color solid interior and the main compartment looks like this and right here although it may not be noticeable at first these are actually separate compartments so there are three compartments to this bag um, and I will just take out what I've got in here and show you how I've got it packed so I've got a thermos container here and there is actually um, a pocket here um, that does kind of fit the container. It's a little bit of a tight squeeze, but the pocket doesn't go all the way down to the bottom. So I just usually find it easier just to stick it in here on the side, just like that. Um, and it fits really well height-wise. Um, what I've got right here is um, her travel potty seat, and I just keep it in a small Jujube wet bag from the Be Equip set. I've got the, I don't know how you say it, Gimars. Uh, folding potty seat and that fits in there really well and it just sticks into the main compartment of the bag. Um, I've also got an Orchid Hearts wipes pouch in here. I just carry a few wipes um, with me all the time and I don't really want the bulk so just carry a few in there. Um, you'll see there's a pocket here. Um, I've just got a wet ones wipe in there. Um, there's a small zipper here. I don't have anything in here. And you'll see there is a, a button snap here. Two buttons, actually. And what comes attached there is this really cute uh, card holder. It just attaches to the front. Um, it also fits in this pocket, which is really cool. Um, I'm not using it right now. I'm using my other card holder because I've been uh, transferring in between bags a lot. So that one fits in the pockets of some of my other bags, um, namely my work bag a little better. So um, there's also, um, I did talk about this pocket. It's a stretchy little pocket here. There's a wider pocket, also elasticized. And in here I have a toilet seat cover and uh, one pull-up. Most of the time we take her out, she's in her big girl undies, but I do keep one of those with me just in case. And that's all I've got in the main pocket of the bag. Um, also notable is that there are two little loops right here, and I didn't know what that was for, but I was watching uh, Clarissa Chin's uh, posts on the Mina Bay Facebook group, and she uses this as a stroller caddy, which I think is just brilliant. Um, 
So you can just hook your loops through here and hook it onto the stroller and it's nice and high and makes a great caddy. I haven't tried it yet, but I will be doing that soon. In the second compartment here, it looks like this. It's a decent size. I've just got um, a mini med kit here. My daughter has allergies, so I always travel with the AviQ. A little a thermometer and some allergy superhero little uh, vials of medicine along with band-aids and some smaller things. And this is a custom Sanrio Sweets uh, pouch. Um, and I think I got this from the Jujube BST Facebook page. But I can also link some Amazon alternatives if you are looking for a med pouch in a similar size. If you would like that, just let me know in the comments. Um, and then in the last smallest compartment, oops, I've just got, um, this is just one of those, uh, disposable placemats, just in case we go to a restaurant, although usually if I'm going to a restaurant, I'll take, um, a little restaurant kit, but, um, this is in here just in case we end up somewhere, and, um, I just have a small snack pack of Belvita crackers or cookies, whatever they're called for my daughter in case she needs a snack. Um, and that's actually all I've got in here. Um, I usually use use this just for quick trips out, excuse me, um, to Costco or a quick trip to the store. So I don't carry much, but I do like to have the essentials and this bag is awesome. I don't think it looks at all like a diaper bag. Um, I will happily use this past the diaper bag stage um, and I'm really happy with it. Uh, the color is beautiful. This is, in case I didn't mention it, top grain leather. It feels really nice. Um, and um, overall, I think it's a win. Um, I'm actually thinking about getting another color in the sale because I like it so much. If you do have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Um, please do like this video and subscribe to my channel. It helps tremendously. And I'm also going to see if I can get some... Uh, on the body shots on my Instagram page, uh, also called the postpartum closet. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you again soon. Bye.